uh, with the ID Tech X show. Hi. Hi. So, who are you? So, my name's Simon Johnson. I'm with a company called CPI from the UK. And uh, what do you do? So CPI is a technology organization. We help companies to understand latest technologies in a wide range of fields. This is about flexible electronics. So we've got capability to produce many meters, hundreds of meters of printed flexible circuits. We do printing, we do electronics assembly on, on flex as well. So what's special about this? This is showing uh, an assembly of a printed silver circuit with a, a small uh, silicon chip fixed on there. It's an NFC label. Um, the key thing really with these sort of technologies is the continuous processing. This is also the same sort of thing where we're printing as an NFC label directly onto a paper label. So a conventionally printed paper label and then the circuit's been printed directly onto the print paper. We've also then mounted the component directly onto there. So it's all in one. There's no additional inlay to create. It's like for security and anti-theft or that something? That type of thing. And in this case, it's a marketing product. It helps to promote the, uh, the product through web links and that type of thing. And um, here you're showing, uh, what is this? So this is a demonstrator product, really. It shows the, the capability of producing hundreds of meters of circuit continuously. So this is just an RGB LED array. Um, we do that because it's quite a fun thing to produce. It also is a very good demonstrator for our tool. But the key thing really is that it's continuous manufacture. And uh, down there? Down here we've got some smart pill packs and we've got a, 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 an intelligent blister pack that can record when your um, tablets are being taken. It does that autonomously. Uh, we've also got some embedded electronics embedded inside a carbon fiber composite here showing uh, wirelessly powering circuits within carbon fiber. Um, there's a lot of more demos around here also? Yep, so these are more blister packs. So every time you pop a pill in this one, um, the electronics here will record the, the time at which the pill was taken. And then finally, you can tap your phone on there and then the data uh, about when you took your tablets is transferred to your, your doctor. Is there like a flexible battery going on here? Yeah, so that's a flexible battery. There's another, another format there. Um, these are really smart devices. They're about 0.6 millimeters thick, 30 are milliamp. You, are yeah. you making them? We don't make them. These are uh, units we're buying in, in this case from a company called Renata, but there are quite a few numbers, quite a few different uh, companies who it's are not manufacturing the these. Oh, Sorry, that that no, it's the Renata is making these. Yep, um, Renata are making those batteries, but there are quite a number of different companies who, who are also doing that. All so right. we, do, we do the assembly, we do the design, we do the print, and all those sort of requirements for these sort of devices. All right, and uh, here on the, on the, on the screen, uh, it's showing some of the behind the scenes, what's happening. It is, so yeah. So where yeah. are you based? So we're based in the north, we're based in the northeast of England. Um, we have uh, five different buildings that we, we're based around. We, we have a wide range of different technologies in those buildings. We've got about 450 people in the company. And you partner with some of the companies around here, right? Or many we, of them? We do. We do a lot of collaborative R&D programs. We do commercial work and we also have funded programs that we, we work on. So, for example, I think you work in Pragmatic? Yeah, Pragmatic's one of our client companies. So they're based in our facility in, in uh, County Durham in, in, in England and um, they have space in our clean room where they are fabricating their devices. So it's, it's not just uh, prototyping and demos and stuff, it's mass production of stuff also? It, it's prototyping but at the mass production scale. The aim is to show scale up and how you can go from a handful of devices to 10,000 or 100,000. Ultimately, we won't do the manufacture, we'll work with other companies to do that, but we help to prove the process and prove the route to doing that.